Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you for being with me again today. We got an article regarding um, talking about the military abilities, capabilities that Ukraine will have and has by being provided with missiles from some Western countries. So um, that will threaten the Russian Navy uh, present in the Black Sea. Fortunately for the um, Russians, they have submarines, so these things will not work. But let's see, what did they get and how could they use them? This uh, article comes from the New Voice of Ukraine, June 9th, 2022, and this is the title. Ukraine's coastal defenses strengthened with U.S. Harpoon missiles, says Defense Minister. We're in bad shape, Russians. That's war. Let's go. I'm quoting. Our coastal defense have been strengthened with high effective harpoon complexes. Complexes. He said. Not necessarily that's true. Okay. That's what they say. But we'll find out, right? Together with our Neptunes, a Ukrainian anti-ship missiles, the harpoons are already forcing the enemy fleet to keep its distance to avoid the fate of the Russian black the fleet flagship, the missile cruiser Moskva, end quote. Ukraine sank the Moskva with two Neptune missiles on April 13. Russia said that had been a fire on board the ships which detonated ammunition. It says the ship was under tow to, Ukraine, to Russian occupied Sevastopol in Crimea, but later admitted the ship has sunk. The fate of the 485 members of the crew of the of the crew of the cruiser is unclear. Russia claims one crew member was killed, 28 were missing, and another 396 were rescued. There is no way to independently verify Russia's claims. There you have it. So, on May 23rd, Denmark announced that it would supply a launcher for Harpoon anti-ship missiles and coastal defense missiles to Ukraine. Well, they say they already have it, right? Isn't that what it is? It says Ukraine's coastal defense is strengthened at the past war, past tense, with U.S. Harpoon missiles. So there you have it. Harpoon missiles with the Neptune, the Russians keep the distance. Well, I, I thought, from what I know, that the sophisticated Navy ship, fighting ships, how you want to call them, they have certain kind of uh, ability to intercept the rockets and hit them in the air when they approach your ship are we still in 1940 here or something what's going on where are those sophisticated air defense mechanisms and missile and bum bim bum all kind of uh, you know terms with all kind of weird names so it uh you know instills fear in the enemy's hearts or something no no okay then keep the distance then you have the submarines what are you gonna do with the submarines though because i posted a video uh, earlier today that uh, Russia, that according to Ukrainians, which obviously they would not say something like this if it's about the Russians, says that hey, the Russians have submarines in the Black Sea, which we know they have armed with uh, uh, caliber cruise missiles, about 20 of them. All right, well, those could take the harpoon launchers. What's going on? I'm waiting. Who's going to give me that information? Uh, Ukrainska Pravda, the new voice of Ukraine, what? TARS, TASS, or whatever that, that is, what news agency? Not CNN, obviously, but nevertheless. So, this is the situation with this. We'll find out what, uh, what will be the outcome. Uh, the outcome definitely will be only destruction, unfortunately. Thank you for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth, and be just.